and welcome to our first vlog from this Vancouver trip. We started out this trip by waking up at 11.30 p.m., which was awful, and getting into your car at around midnight to drive from Windsor up to Toronto. So naturally, in the middle of the night, we grabbed a Tim Hortons breakfast, which was okay, but the coffee was probably the worst coffee I've ever had in my life. Thankfully, I was able to grab a Starbucks from the shop. That's a lot better. So we are currently in Toronto Pearson Airport and we are going to Vancouver in BC, which will be our first time both of us being there. Yeah. And we're really, really excited. Yeah. But we're very tired. My bags have bags. I feel that. <laughs> You're laughing at my eyes. <laughs> Not laughing at my joke. <laughs> <laughs> So we got ready to get on the plane and Devon had actually taken us to the wrong gate for a while, so that was great. It was around a five and a half hour flight, I believe, so we were going to watch a film together, but Devon ended up falling asleep before we even took off, so I just watched it on my own. But the flight wasn't too bad, there was a lot of really beautiful views, especially as we were coming into Vancouver. looking a little rough. We have very red eyes and we're running on about five hours sleep collectively between the plane and sleeping in the middle of the day yesterday. It is around 12 o'clock now noon so we have been up for around 13 hours. So we got to our Airbnb and we actually had a wee bit of baller checking in um, but we got there eventually and then we ventured down to the shops to kind of get some shopping in to get like shampoo conditioner all that kind of stuff that we didn't bring with us and to get some snacks for what we have planned for the rest of today if you've watched my previous vlogs you might remember me mentioning that the one experience i really wanted to have this year was whale watching and that is what we're going to go do today and i'm just hoping that we see some in Vancouver, you have the opportunity to see humpback whales and to possibly see killer whales or orcas, which is what I really, really want to see. I mean, humpback whales would also be really, really cool. I wouldn't be complaining, but if I only saw humpbacks, then I definitely want to come back and try to see the killer whales. We only have about two hours from now to get ready and make our way there. And ideally, I was wanting to stop at this market and I believe it's called the Granville Public Market. There's lots of like fresh fruit, vegetables, um, there's like fish and chips, and there's like apparently a really, really good donut place and a really good bagel place. Our first impressions of Vancouver are actually really good so far. We love it here and we've been here like two hours. If we don't see any whales, the company that we're going with actually has like a guarantee that you can come back for free every single time until you see a whale. Devon has joined. Crack. I'm excited. I can't wait. I'm so excited. My best friend right now. We're almost finished. It's almost time to go. We are actually going to walk down to the ferry and we're going to get the ferry over to Granville Island. For this trip, I actually bought a Lululemon belt bag and joined the rest of the basic Canadian girls. I don't know why I didn't join them sooner, to be honest, because my life has changed. So this is the belt bag that I was telling you about. It is the two liter everyday bag, I think it's called. It literally has changed my life. So this is the bathroom right now. It's a wee bit of a bomb because I was just getting ready. It's nice. And then we have like the washing machines. Then we come out here. This is the main door. There's Devon having his snacks. This is the bedroom, which again, it's a wee bit of a mess right now because we just kind of came in and threw everything into the kitchen. So it's kind of like a studio almost, but not really. Then we have our balcony out here. Did you just lock that? <laughs> oh my God, you're such a dick. That is a wee tour of the Airbnb. Are you ready? Yes, I am. Hey, oh, let's go. Gang Vancouver.
called seven. I feel like I give mine a six. That was the best market I've ever been to. Oh, for definite. There was so much. There's so many options. Yeah. Overwhelmed in the best way. Yeah. We bought some donuts from Lee's Donuts. That's supposed to be like the best donuts ever. Yeah. So when we get on the boat, we're gonna have them try not to throw up because we've had so much food. I go for some more. Okay, so we're on the boat now. We decided to sit at the very, very back of the boat. And we're gonna have our donuts just before we get going. So I got yeah, the sugar and Devin got the raspberry one. Okay. Cheers. This is really good. Both are really good. So after our donuts, we set out on the boat. And even though it was 30 degrees Celsius and roasting off the boat, it was absolutely freezing once we went full speed. But it was a beautiful day and we had a lot of fun. The first thing that we saw were some sea lions that were sunbathing. They were very, very cute. And then we set off to find the whales. And the first thing that we spotted were actually two adult humpback whales. They ended up coming really close up to the boat. And even the guide said that we were really lucky that we had such a close look at them. So. This was an absolutely unreal experience. a good look at those two we set off again and saw some dolphins on the way while we had our hot chocolate and we ended up spotting three more humpback whales except this time it was two adults and a calf which was very very cool now the mother and calf did not come as close as the two humpbacks that we had saw before obviously but it was still really cool to see the two of them swimming together and at one stage the calf was actually like playing around a wee bit and sticking its like fins in the air which was very cute to see but yeah again absolutely amazing <laughs> off having we look at those whales we went out to the surrounding areas and ended up seeing a few bald eagles which was very cool and we stopped at a few lighthouses and saw some sights as well on the way back before jumping on to another wee ferry to head back over to our Airbnb. Hello so We've just gotten in, we're very, very tired, and we're just ordering some food in, to be honest. We gain our energy. Yeah, so. Stanley Park mm -hmm. So, if you made it to the end of this vlog, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe so we don't miss our next day in Vancouver. But it is night night from us for now. Bye. Bye. Still done. <laughs>